Good evening. Welcome to Jim Munley's World of Weather. Clicked on to long range with forecast discussion for August 15th to 27th. August 15th to 19th, the patterns forecast consists of a ridge here west of the Aleutians. We have a trough over the Aleutians and Gulf of Alaska. We also have a fairly strong ridge along the west coast. Subtropical ridge is forecast across the southern U.S. And you see this Bermuda ridge starts to retreat and gets suppressed. And we'll go through the gauge and see this happening. It builds in a little bit, then starts decreasing. And this will be the pattern, and this will occur as this trough here digs into central U.S. Heavy rainfall is forecast from the southern plains northeast to the Great Lakes. Rainfall in the east will gradually decrease as the western electric ridge, ridge weakens. Temperature in the west will be above normal. Temperatures will, will cool across the northern plains up the Mississippi Valley. We're going to look now at the pattern for August 18th to the 22nd. Here we are at the 19th. And you still see we have our trough here, ridge configuration. We also have a ridge here over the East Pacific. This trough starts to dig in. And this trough, uh, this ridge would be across the U.S. and it'll be weaker. And we'll also have this ridge here over the Southeast starts to retreat to the East. And we'll go through the days. This is a GFS. And see, it's almost gone except the subtropical ridge across the southern U.S. And we go to the 22nd, and you see that it is almost gone. And we'll look at the um, other models. You see, they're a good agreement with this forecast. So during this forecast period, I am still forecasting above normal temperatures here and for the southeast, middle Atlantic, and the northeast with anomalies of two degrees above normal, below normal temperatures here due to the truck digging in. And we'll have anomalies of, about, of at least three degrees below normal. This might be a little underdone because I saw some anomalies of forecast six degrees below normal. We'll see how that is. For precipitation, the low normal precipitation forecast for the northwest, and above normal precipitation forecast for the southern plains, east and northeastward, covering the south, um, the southeast, the middle Atlantic, and the northeast. Now we're going to look at the period for August 23rd to the 27th. Here we are at the 23rd. Now this is a GFS. You see we have now fairly uh, ridge. Uh, trough beginning to be insert itself in the east. We have this above normal heights here. And we back this up a little bit. We also have a trough along the um, west over the east Pacific. And we have a ridge here in the west. And this trough here gets uh, begins to dig in due to very strong uh, positive height anomalies and a ridge here over the Aleutians. Then we go to the end of the period. We still, this is a GFS, still has a trough. Here's a GFS ensembles. If you look at the European determinants, still evidence of a broad cyclone flow across the northern US. And then the, the um, Canadian is the flatter of the flow of the model. So during this forecast period, still forecasting above normal temperatures here with anomalies of near 12 degrees above normal and above normal temperatures here, but lower anomalies with anomalies of three to six degrees above normal, below normal temperatures here, with anomalies of three to nine degrees below normal for precipitation, calling for below normal precipitation for the West Coast states and above normal precipitation is forecast for the Southern Plains Eastward covering the southeast and the lower mid Atlantic. So that is a long range weather forecast discussion for August 15th to 27th. Thanks for coming to Jim Mummy's World of Weather and have a good day.